Now, listen, I come to the PD liaison in a time of need. <laughs> oh, believe me, I know we are. Oh, well... You mean you're in a time of need? I'm in a time of need. I need to speak on behalf of the citizens of L the LS. You got what I mean? Ah. Oh. Okay. They, I thought that was the mayor. No, no, no. Um, okay. I actually got Not told bad. by them to talk to you. Oh, okay, great. Mr. Uh, Mr. Fury. Can I talk to Mr. Fury? <laughs> this guy's a dumbass. We can go in. K Fury, dude. Go talk inside. What the fuck is this? It's a rug? Not sure. Let's go talk inside. For right now, like, you know, getting new people on. Boom! So. How you doing, sir? Mm. All right, come on. I'll take you to the meeting room. Now, I got told to come to the PD liaison when it comes to uh, concerns and complaints. Okay. And let me tell you, Dakota. Okay. Boy, do we have a list. All right. I am fucking disgusted with All the right. vile trash you are unleashing. Upon these citizens, hard-working businessmen. Let me just clarify: I'm not unleashing anything. I'm, uh, I'm an officer, but I am your uh, conduit for information. So I'm happy to. Oh, uh, just to listen. another guy who's gonna write shit down and not do shit. No, well, no. actually, that, that's not true. Too. I actually have a seat at the table, so I won't do nothing. He's got a seat at the table, table, Mr. K. City the Council. Oh, that dog shit fucking table. What? Yeah. Fuck hey, what? that table. What's wrong with that table? Oh, you know, the, I'm a slumlord, aren't I? I'm a fucking slumlord. Go ahead. Slumlord? Who said that? Oh, act stupid. Like, you don't know who said that. Wait, did someone actually call you a slumlord? Yeah. You, you want to know who? In that stupid fucking council. Who was it? Fucking Edda or whatever the fuck. The treasurer? Yeah. They call me a fraud, a scammer. Fuck everyone on that council. Everyone? Yeah. That's a lot of bridges. And the burn, goddamn okay. PD. They ruined my life yesterday. They Bankrupt ruined your all life. My wait, 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 let, me, let, me, let me tell you something here, Nakoda. Let me tell you something. Okay. How far can you go? You know, if you really want to whip out your belt of power, how far can you whip or can you go? Uh, I mean, it depends on what's being asked of me, Rami. One of your captains is corrupt. Ruth. Ooh. Incompetent, incoherent, and an absolute monster. I'm she, listening. She needs to go. <laughs> she needs to go. <laughs> All right. Let me explain what, what? to you what happened. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go for it. <laughs> <laughs> Did you even man. see this? <laughs> I am a hard-working businessman. I provide affordable housing to many people, including the police department. I run out PD watchtowers in the south side to help them get a better eye on the crime down there. I've been known to find government equipment in the uh, canals and return them back to police. Oh, damn. That's I've been nice. known to snitch. I'm a snitch. I'll tell snitch you anything. Season. I'm a good man. And all I did was help the PD. And this is how I get fucking treated? I was driving around in the south side, Jamestown. Uh -huh. Me and my boy, Ryman. We came across a police scene. Which turned out to be Mary Mushkin's house. There was Mary Mushkin, Jaeger, a couple of their goons, and a bunch of police officers talking to them. He told me and Rami were just sitting on the other side of the intersection like, Oh, what's going on? We're just chatting. The intersection's all jammed up with cars because of police cars. Once the police drive off, it quickly clears and we drive across the intersection. We get pulled up on okay. by Jaeger and his goons. And they start hitting our car with crowbars. Oh. Saying, this is them. Me and Rami are sitting there clueless. We're like, what the fuck you is that? I'm a lawyer, Nakoda. I'm clear, yeah. rec clean record and everything. This guy's a, he's yeah. a businessman. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mary Mushkin and her goons 
pull up behind us in a car and start shooting at us. Jeez, wait. Oh, they were shooting at you? Bro, yes. we got gunned down? They gunned me down. They then take Rummy at the car and hold him up with knives. Did you end up getting shot, Rummy? No, I didn't get... They shot at me, but I didn't get hit. K got... Mm. K got... Hang on, like, it got hit up. Lit up? Yep. Okay. Yeah. I was in a red car, then they <laughs> tossed a gun on me. They, they put a gun on me. So take Rami at knife point. Johnson, the police officer, pulls up. He sees this for some reason. Let's everyone with the knives go. Arrest Rami and me. Then, you know, cops come on scene. I'm being treated by EMS. Uh, a cop named uh, Viv or something? Mm -hmm. Vivian Gray. T mm -hmm. Vivian Gray tells the EMS, hold on. While the EMS is working on me, hold on. I need to frisk and search him. Stops what they're doing. I'm squirting blood out of my fucking wounds. All right. Searches me, frisks me, okay. finds a planted gun. Oh, God. Then they finally let the EMS start treating me again. I'm almost dying over here. And keep in mind, the first thing she did was GSR me, and I was negative. Completely negative. Wrong okay. me, too. Okay. But because he had I a pity put gun in the ambulance, <laughs> they dragged me out, they're searching me, they're cuffing me, they're treating me like a fucking skunk. They said, oh, right after the shooting, uh, we got a call saying a guy in a red car had a gun. Typical fucking plan. They put us in that car. They were trying to rob mm -hmm. us and like drive off. But then the cops got on scene, they all dipped out. Johnson was focused on us instead of the fucking mm -hmm. people that literally had guns on us. Mm -hmm. So and then what? we told the cops, the, we said, oh, that's Mary Mushkin and Jaeger. You guys were literally talking to them five seconds before all this happened at their house. The, they don't care. What, what happened they after? All the way. They don't do nothing. They just fucking throw us around like scum. Dakota, what happened after that? You want to know what happened after that? Tell me. Oh, no. Wait no, no, no. I tell you what happened yesterday, Ram. They, they, they admit, they admit that they shouldn't mm -hmm. have even searched K because the G, he, he came back GSR negative, number one. Then because they searched him and had the planted PD gun on him. Mm hmm they let him go, take the PD gun, and then the next day, go ahead, Kay. Go ahead. The next day, uh, I'm being a paralegal for Rami. I'm trying out the legal game, you know what I'm saying? All right. And we get called down for Dundee. So we're doing our thing. Okay. There's a situation where Dundee was driving a tanker, and he, he detached the tanker, drove off, cops started shooting at him, and then the cops accidentally shot the tanker, blowing up a bunch of people in cars. And they were trying to get him all these murders, and I was like, oh, listen, McNulty. Regardless of whatever charges you want to give, uh, you, you need to recognize that there was a fuck up on the PD side here. You guys shot when it was not yet safe to shoot, yet you didn't have, there was no urgency to shoot. He detached from the tanker. He was getting away from the tanker. You guys shot and blew it up. He didn't like what he was hearing. So he says, okay, I got to go review some stuff. Goes away for 20 minutes. Me and Rami are just locked down there like, okay, where's everybody? Ruth, Captain Ruth. Pushes a warrant out on me while I'm in there doing my legal work. They lock. They had, that's why they left. They started trying to lock me in. They were locking doors and they just disappeared for 20 minutes. So what they did, what they did is because they had this shit, they had the warrant ready to go, but they didn't post anything on like the MDT or anything. So the second K went down there to be a paralegal, she then posted the warrant and then they just locked him down there and then raided him for the PD gun oh, no, that no, got no, planted. No, 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 they didn't even... I was locked down there for a while, and I'm like, what are you talking about? That shit was playing on me. I gave you names and everything. Did you talk to the people I gave you the names of? No. They didn't do a proper investigation. They never talked to Mary. They never talked to Jaeger. They didn't do anything. They just took, okay, well, we found them. We're going to charge them. They never looked into it. They didn't do the proper procedures. They just waited until I pissed off on the officers, put the warrant out on me, arrested me in there when they had me there, and just started throwing me around. They tried to bring me on this raid, and the whole time, they're just talking to me like I'm guilty until proven innocent. They're trying to get me to take out a car at Group 6. Have you ever done Group 6, sir? I have. I have indeed. So you understand. You, you need a phone to sign on. Then you have to ready up for the jobs. Yep. Then you have to wait for a job and get a job. I was trying to tell them this. They're telling me I'm, res I'm not cooperating. I'm saying I need a phone to sign on. They finally give me a phone. They don't put a SIM card in it, so I can't actually get a job. I'm trying to tell them that. They're not fucking listening. They call a judge down there, Judge Gatsby, to scold me and say, we're going to give you contempt of court if you keep resisting. I'm saying, I'm ready up for a job. There's no jobs coming in because you didn't give me a fucking SIM card. So they keep giving me that same attitude the whole time. They go and try to raid my properties. Apparently, they don't know how to find my properties. They don't know how to go on the real estate app and type in Brogue Avenue 10. Like, oh, that one's not coming up. Well, they look up 9 and find 10. And they already know where my fucking properties are. 
They're not even riding, trying to raid my property. They're raiding all my fucking rentals. They're raiding the ones I, I ran out the police. They mm -hmm. were just treating me like vile scum. It, it was it was disgusting. Okay. That yeah, does sound doesn't sound great. They don't give me a fair trial. There's no judges. I can't do no bench trial because there's other trials going on and all the cops are fucking busy. You mean I for the warrant? Thirty thousand mm -hmm. dollars. My my okay. all my real estate's been bankrupt. I got investors to pay. They ruined my life. Oh, listen, Nakota, as the PD lays on, we're basically putting in a fucking a handful of fucking complaints against Ruth. She, need, she, okay. she, she needs to be dealt with, striked, adapted, whatever the fuck. I don't know. Because I'm confused when they have plenty of evidence to at least detain Jaeger and Mary Mushin for questioning. I mean, Jaeger right. tweeted out a picture that same day, what, mm -hmm. the same day I got shot, yeah. of him killing my friend Richard on Twitter. And we gave this to Slacks. Oh, and still, have? okay, I was just still ask nothing. If you have it, okay. I'm just, I'm just, I don't understand why the fuck I'm getting charged with such a serious crime when I got so much on the line. Yeah. And didn't even do the full proper procedures. How are you gonna charge me with, uh, you know, stealing a fucking police weapon? You what I'm telling you is yeah, planted. Yeah, yeah. There's plenty of evidence showing that it's planted. I'm giving you names of people that it's planted, and you never even went and talked to them. You know what's even worse? This is Murphy's court case the same basis? He got found I saw, guilty. I, I, I saw it. Crazy. Night, and, I saw and, 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 and and the prosecutor... But was GSR negative? It don't matter, Kay. But I mean, yeah, fucking, the, it still the, helps. It'd be a criminal use if you were GSR Yeah, if you, it don't matter. The, yeah. the sad reality is right now, the way the law is written, possession is still nine-tenths of the law. If you have it on yeah. your possession, you have to have like... Yo, the prosecutor... It's frustrating to hear. You it's have so to have stupid. Hard, hard... Like you would... And this is... I can empathize with you because you would literally need a video of someone without a mask on placing the gun in your back pocket yeah. in order to combat... But it's part. crazy to me because they search the properties, right? Find nothing. Yeah. I've had I have history of people trying to plant shit on me. Slacks knows this. Someone planted like what twenty fucking bricks on our lawn, and there was a whole report uh, on it. This time and third. I remember reading so about been that. Yeah, people trying to frame me, and they just they just throw it out the window. They don't do any proper procedures and just fucking ruin my life. Yeah, twenty bricks in a yard is kind of overkill, huh? They really. Oh yeah, twenty bricks slick, in a note huh? that says, "Oh, here's an order for." Ordered by Kay and Rami, like what? He did this shit. <laughs> yeah. Same with the same with this gun. Like, oh, we just shot this guy. Now we're gonna call in. There's a guy in a red car with a gun. Okay. Okay. Uh, well, I'll be honest. I. It, it sounds like there's a lot going on between all these scenarios. It's Ruth. Listen, listen, listen. Forget everything that happened to him. Like, it, our issue is Ruth. It's Ruth. So if if you had to distill this all down to... Is, is I don't the... think she's in it for justice. I think she's in it for herself. Okay. She just wants to seem like she fucking knows everything. It's She wants to be right. She don't care about doing the right thing. And she don't care about true justice. And if you confront her about it, oh, she's she's definitely not going to fucking change that. She doesn't know how to... She's she, going to stick to yeah. it just to stick to it. If you, don't, if you don't... It's either her way or the highway. And if you don't... And if you like push you back at her, she gets twenty four hour hold because they she does dumb shit. Properties. Uh, and then I had someone okay. else. I'm like, hey, find Brogue Avenue ten. They found it in ten seconds. I'm gonna be real. They're Nakota, incompetent. So then they put it on you because they don't know how to do their fucking Nakota, job, and they want you to do your job for them. She managed to ruin single handedly. She single handedly managed to ruin the entire reputation of the PD to the entire city. The entire city is literally against the PD right now because oh, of her. her. Literally I'm because her. of her. Because of her. She managed to ruin the entire reputation to have everybody against the PD, just because of her acting alone in her own in her own interests. Okay. Well, I'm not gonna lie to you both right now and say, uh, you know, I can snap my fingers and do anything. And I know this. you know, Nakota. By the way, I don't mean to cut you off. I know you know that the other officers have the same complaints about her. I know there's other. I can name five off the bat that have the same complaints that, uh, about her. That the citizens of Los Santos have. So if her own people are, have, are complaining about her, then there's a common denominator at some point. You know what I mean? She didn't even yeah, know about the hit, and, the hit and Rami thing, the legislation. She tried arresting me on it. Oh, the felony? Uh, yeah. She doesn't even know. No, she doesn't not, even know the is laws. Is it felony anymore? Or is it the... It, it, they didn't post no, no, that yet, right? yeah, It's still in the case it's, itself. Yeah, right? it's in the, it's in the thing, it. but they didn't put... But it don't matter. Like, she, doesn't, she doesn't know anything. She just does whatever she wants because she's a captain and nobody's going to tell her no. That's the problem. Well, the first thing I'm going to have to do is uh, I got to read up on all these reports because I don't think I was part of any of the the scene with uh, you being found with the firearm. 
So I'm coming into it completely blind, which is probably a good thing. Um, so I have your, you know, your whole statement right now. Right. I can see exactly what people wrote, hopefully, uh, in there as far as the uh, steps that were taken and what yeah. everyone's articulation is. And well, hopefully uh, another it will be. thing, too, was like. Yeah, go ahead. So the one officer, Vivian Gray, she did have EMS stop treating me to frisk me for a moment. And then I brought that up, and they just denied. They said, "No, that never happened. No, no, that's not right." Like what, motherfucker? I was on the, I was the one on the ground bleeding. I know what happened. Okay. Was there any, uh, was there like any seniors or captains on the scene of this? The uh... slacks. Slacks was there. Okay. Was Root Did... there too, Roman? For the original? Uh, I don't know. Did you guys approach? Slacks at all? I mean, Mr. K, obviously you were shot. Oh, yeah. So, bro, I bro, bro right. this is why we're here. Okay. He doesn't believe in uh, discipline on his peers. He doesn't have the balls to do something like that. Okay. All right. Uh, well, I have all this. I know, you know. Like to be I honest, said, you Slacks is promoting her behavior. <laughs> but that's a whole other story. No, I know, but the, you know, the immediate, I, I get what the concern is here. So, um, I will have to look over the reports and then obviously then I can move forward. But with all the information you've just given me, that gives me a, a much broader perspective on what happened, which is going to be helpful. Right. Um, like I said, I'll try not to, uh, I will. Make sure that I get myself up to date on everything. If anything else comes of any of this, please let me know. Okay. Like if you're, I don't know. Are you, did you say you were on a hold and now you're out? Yeah, you well, yeah they I'm held not, them for the raid. I was on a hold because they didn't know how to, they know how to uh, do raids. Oh, okay. What, so they could, you're saying they could yeah. find the property? Yo, it's Larry, bro. Yeah, I have okay. your number. What's up? Okay, listen. I witness, you know Sora as a cop, right? And, yeah. Uh, and he has a little hot dog business, right? Yeah. You fuck, you fuck with four ass. Hell like, no. He... All right, bet this is even better. So me and another person, we witnessed like two cops and four ass stealing a fucking hot dog, uh, the little hot dog car, right? And then I thought she was like jury rigging, right? Because you you can tell if a cop is like jury rigging or lock picking. Yeah. Bro, these these cops, they were a lot picking the door, bro, and they get the fucking taco truck. And then what we were thinking, right? What if we report that taco truck stolen? We report it stolen, and when they ask like who stole it, be like those two cops did it. Just get motherfuckers fired, bro. Fire everybody. Fire, 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 fire. I fire. like I like the idea, but I'm gonna keep yeah. it honest with you. Stack one thousand with the way the PD is right now, the motherfuckers get high fived and slap ass. You know what I mean? What? Yeah, bro. Come on. Hey, bro. They're not gonna get striked or nothing. What? Hell no. Hell what no. The fuck. Hell fucking no. I mean, do it and see what happens, and then I got you on, as a lawyer if you if it gets crazy and if you want to sue them and shit or whatever. But yeah. I'm, I'm telling you, right, that shit ain't gonna go nowhere, bro. Because I know the PD, bro. No. Hey, bro. Man. Hey, man. We took twelve steps backwards, brother. <laughs> twelve. We took eight years backwards, brother. <laughs> yeah, you ain't wrong. You ain't wrong. You ain't wrong. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually a good one. Okay, listen. All right, if you record it next time, record it on your phone. All right, I should some pictures. Yeah, yeah. All right, okay. All right, brother. All right, bye. Uh, once they're uh, assembled, so. Okay, we'll, we'll and, do that. Yeah, I don't know when they're holding the elections for that. Do you know? Did Malton talk to you about that, Rami? What? Civilian oversight. Yeah, he said. Um, when they're gonna get that together? It's supposed to be soon, soon. right? Soon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But okay. he, Malton's the head of it. But then I, I talked to him. He told me he'll he, to go to you. Okay, perfect. Okay. But I was saying also to Mr. K that this is something when that is running at full steam that you could bring to him too, and then they they can like look into it, look into it. Yeah, that makes sense. I couldn't even have my lawyer on the on the on the radio. You, you, you know you want you want, yeah, and but you want, and you don't know what's funny as well, Nakota, because of the way uh, we proved uh, Ruth wrong. She went, her and Slacks went and complained to uh, Malton about me to put in a quote-unquote formal mm -hmm. complaint you know what you know what malton did i told malton go talk to maple who was there on scene of everything that happened you know what mm -hmm. maple did maple the cop that like doesn't like us k mm -hmm. Ma uh, maple backed my story up and supported my story and malton threw it out 
to prove During to you. Go talk to Malton. Go talk to Malton. Okay. I didn't hear. Oh, they, they never even they, showed me my search warrant, and they they kicked my lawyer. Out. They 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 literally they're they're literally bitching to them because we proved them wrong. They don't like it. They don't like when somebody opposes them. But when what, someone what so is on the projector, by the way, what the fuck are you guys watching in here? Wait, what do you mean? Oh, Does you guys our... don't see anything out there? I see. Something. No. That Kurt Angle. You do? Oh, wait, is it? Yeah, it, it, my eyes. I just might need to clean my eyes. I don't know, but I know what you're talking about. Yeah, it's like the base screen saver. Oh, right this now. was my face. This was our face when this, everything was going down yesterday. Honestly, <laughs> you know. Honestly, yeah. Yep. All right. Really furrowed. Not surprised. Brown. You know, it's like all right, shocked but not surprised. You know, that's the face. All right. Um. All right. Well, I will get going <laughs> on all this. It's a lot, but I uh, I want you to at least hear me say it. I I understand where you're coming from. So. Okay. I, uh, I try to be as approachable as possible, right? Oh, of uh, course, brother. Part of, so do I. Part of my so position, do I. No, you so. don't. No, so, no, <laughs> so do I. I try to be as approachable as possible. We're very approachable. I've never found you to be unapproachable. I thank you, Nakoda. Honest. Honestly, thank you. I appreciate that. That means that go. That means a lot, Nakoda. Okay. And Mr. K, I don't know you that well either, but I don't think I've ever had an issue with. Listen, me. you know, if you use logic in the way you operate, it's not hard, you know. Uh, that's literally what I base everything around, so. I wish you, other, other officers, you know, thought like you. All right, well, let me, uh, let me help you guys out here, and, uh, right. yeah, I will, uh, I got a lot of fucking reading ahead of me, so. Sure. Oh, you guys want to go out that way? You I mean, that's fine. I don't give a shit. There you go, boys. All right, thanks. All right, thank you for coming. I appreciate it. I'll okay, come here. Later, right? Yeah, yeah. Come here. Johnson. Johnson wants to uh Johnson wants to talk to me one on one. Like apologizing shit. If you want, you can black out rob him while I'm talking to him. I'll do it like in the center of the Look park or something. I'll do it in like the center of the park or some shit and we rob him for his gun. How about I just smoke his bitch ass? Well I kinda want the gun, you know what I mean? Yeah. Take it off his dead fucking body. There's no coming back from that, you know, right? That's what I'm saying. So why don't you just, gonna know it's you. just black out and rob him? Let me talk to him no, as a setup. They're going to know you're involved. What? How? What do you mean? You're... It's fucking obvious. 